Hey what's up guys welcome back to my youtube channel and in this video I am going to talk about 5 windows 10 application which can make you more productive than ever. So if you are a mac user like me or if you have been using mac then also this video is must for you because I will talk about some of the mac's experiences which you can get in windows as well. So yeah this is uh, the video which you should watch till the end so that you can know about these productive applications. So the first application which I'm going to talk about here would be Yuli. So if I go here, just let me show you Yuli. So as it says, a keystroke launcher for Windows and Mac OS. So basically it works on Windows as well and it works on Mac OS as well. So the basic idea is similar to like if you have used Mac, then there is something called Spotlight which comes by default on Mac, which is free. And the second thing is uh, Alfred, which is a paid uh, application in Mac, which does all this work. So similarly, there is Yuli. There are other applications as well, but I like this particular application a lot. It's very it's easy to set up, like you don't have to do anything. You can just download it from here and it's totally free. You don't have to pay anything. And once you download it on the uh, bottom right corner, you will see an icon of it and you can just go to settings and you can like uh, set it up. You can make uh, some theme customization as well. By default, the hotkey which it uses is Alt plus Space, but you can change the preference like you can use uh, Control plus Space, Shift plus Space, whatever you want to use. But I'll go with Alt plus Space because I'm used to it now and you can like customize it entirely. There are many plugins which it uses in like uh, for, for all these uh, features which it has. So you can like enable and disable them. So let me just give you a quick idea what you can do with Yuli. So I'll press Alt plus Space. And this is the bar which I get. I can do some cal calculation over here. Let's say 42 into 54 and it gives me 2268. That is fine. I can open any application. Let's say if I say Visual Studio. So you can get like Visual Studio, Visual Studio Code and all those things. I can also convert currency. Let's say I want to see how much INR would be in 100 USD. So I can say 100 USD in INR and you can see 7553 INR. So currency conversion is there, right? Something like RGBA and you can give something like 255, 122, 105 and 1. So it will give you the hex color, RGB, RGBA, HSL and all that. Yeah, pretty cool stuff. You can also perform some um, operating system commands. Let's say shut down and restart. So all of these things are pretty handy. You can use them. Then you can also use this arrow key and you can perform command line operation. Let's say you can ping 1.1.1 something like this or you can also do let's say I can run flutter doctor. So any command line operation which you want to do you can do with this in a very easy way. Then you can do translations. You can do web search. Let's say if I want to open mtechviral.com. You can also send emails. You can see this is now open and pretty doing pretty good job. You want to search on Google something, then you can say G question mark and you can write any query. Let's say Yuli app and it will open Google with this search thing. And that looks pretty good, right? So this was the first application. The second application which I want to talk about here is quick look. So again, it gives you the same Mac experience. So quick look, you can go to Microsoft store. And once you go there, you will search for quick look, the first application which will come with, let me just search and here you go. So the first application here is quick look. You have to install this application and trust me, it is worth installing. It is by Paddy Zoo. And now what it, it uh, does is that if I go to file explorer, I can go to any of my video and I can like just press, like select that video and just press a space bar to just give uh, so, just just have a overview of that particular thing like you can hey guys so uh, uh, technically you can use it entirely but let's say if i go to um maybe wallpaper section then also you can see like i can browse these wallpapers like uh, just pressing with a button by a space bar it's that simple so quick look is something which you must have seen in uh, mac os already but yes on windows also it is possible using quick look so yes, go ahead and install this application as well. The third application which I want to talk about is something which is available by Microsoft on GitHub. It is in preview that is Power Toys. 
there are many feature with which uh, particular uh, this application gives you but uh, i think the most uh, like important one out of this like there is keyboard manager image resizer file explorer and all but the most important one which i'll just show you would be fancy zones so fancy zones is something by which you can create your own zones which help you in managing different windows or different uh, you can say um, yeah windows basically so if i click here on launch zones editor then you can see focus columns rows priority grid grid you can select any of them and you can then apply and how it works is let's say you have an window open you can just go to any corner and you can push it like this as you can see you can select the entire area like this and maybe you can just select this particular here so it's very easy to manage if even you can like go to this area then you can maybe like you can uh, open multiple uh, maybe windows like this yes so you can see like this looks pretty good this is very easy way to manage your windows so this is definitely something which can make you more productive in terms of using multiple windows all together so go ahead and install that fourth application which i'm gonna talk about here is revo uninstaller pro so on windows especially we install a lot of application and we uninstall a lot of them and what happens when you uninstall any application then it does not remove all the registry files and all those things which probably not important for you or which are occupying some space for no reason so you can use this application revo uninstaller pro although it is not free it is paid but it is worth uh, using and it can remove all the unnecessary components from your particular pc or laptop and it, it works pretty well so i think it's it's a really good thing to try the last one which i want to talk about here would be one of my favorites that is something sharex so sharex is the application why i'm saying why most of us won't be using because in windows there is a very good uh, snippets tool which comes by default and then now it has even improved uh, to take screenshot but this particular application does more than just taking the screenshot so let's say if i am opening this particular um, maybe this this particular site and now i can use share x from here and i can capture either the full screen window a particular reason a particular monitor i can do screen recording i can do screen recording in gif i can also um, capture the text from a particular screen using the ocr tech and uh, yeah there are a lot of features so let me just select a uh, full screen and you can see we have this full screen where it went <laughs> that's interesting okay we have this uh, this particular thing and you can edit this image as well so this is this is basically editing and now you can see like you can have rectangles border colors some like there are more options like this so you can have you can highlight things like this you can have text and uh, there's a lot of things you can magnify something like this thing okay maybe i i just i'm just trying you can put some sticker over here let's try that if that works yes so you can just have some sticker I mean, there are a lot of things you can do you can have some steps you can have some arrows something like this i mean you can have text freehand a lot of stuff and it is really really very very useful apart from that share x gives you like uh, ability to upload files to folder like uh, to particular url and all then it is a hotkey settings by which you can like you know uh, have some shortcuts by which you can exactly uh, use all these features using those shortcuts so that's pretty good i think you can use it any day and sharex is something which i use regularly i like it gives you all this uh, screenshot at one place without saving as well so maybe you can save it later so all these things are there which is not present in by default what you get as a screenshot uh, taker or a replacement of this particular application so now uh, these are my five application which i think makes me very much productive when i'm using windows 
there is one more which i want to talk about here as a bonus and that is some for someone who wants to uh, create tutorials or something so there is something called microsoft whiteboard it's really good i am even using it on uh, my ipad pro and you can see it has this whiteboard you can choose different colors and you can draw something over here the good part is that there is something called a scale which works really well you can draw a line very easily on this scale and let me just you can see the line right so yeah this is pretty pretty good let me just try to draw one more line over here using the scale it works pretty well and uh, even the eraser is depending on how you are moving your cursor works pretty well so this is something which you should definitely try if you want to explain few things to some people if you have a touch pen specifically then it is really important so yeah i think these are the most productive application which i am using these days on windows i'll come with more such application in the future let me know how you like this video so if you enjoyed then press the like button subscribe to the channel also press the bell icon to get future updates thanks for watching and i'll see you in the next video bye bye take care